black, the moon, and the middle stand for peace. This is our, our national color, and our slogan is, and might not be the best, but it's definitely fair. This is where we are. Our country lies in the, between France and Germany. It's about 48 degrees north and 10 degrees east. This is um, all our cities in the country. Coral Josiah. The star represents the capital of the um, This is like um, places where we are. The fields of strawberries, fields of grapes, and like the gourmet food company, and the tallest mountain is the temperature. The temperature. We have all of the temperature. Well, the temperature. Like 
Lastly, is our tax. Our, there are tax by income and property. Uh, we don't tax like other things like sales because it might be too much and it will make the citizens unhappy and we want everyone to be more happy. So, and the larger the income and land, the more the taxes. This is the distribution of the tax money. We have um, education, technology, agriculture, <coughs> jobs, military, healthcare, pub and public utilities. <coughs> education. The government will build public schools for our uh, citizens and permanent residents. Um, we provide school from elementary to high school. That's the socialism of design utilities. The design government builds public utilities for the citizens to use an example like the internet. The government also provides transportation for them. rights and responsibility of the citizens. Citizens have natural and equal rights as a human. They can influence the country if two-thirds of the citizens agree like we said before. And the citizens are in charge of half of the military since the citizens make up the army. A healthy country. Hosea provides 50 of all health care for permanent residents. Since if, if a person's poor and they have no money, but since all of us are equal, everyone has to get the same amount, everyone has, gets to have 50%. And how can they be considered in this country? First is you can live in a socialist design for at least five years. Um, up until you can marry another design citizen. Or you can just apply for a visa. Yeah, yeah, visa. Um, oh, visa, so this is like how it looks like. That you have, they have a name and they have a brother and sister because it's in social media. And the age, the city of birth, and now the and birthday. Army, we have the Air Force, we have a ground, name, ground army, but no Navy because we are not surrounded in, in any sites by water, so it was not that. You have to join the army for two years service when you are 18 years old. All genders can enter. Um, if you are going to university or are going to have a job, you do not have to join. It's optional. Um, these are the levels of the army. The um, active army is 15,000. Um, it's quite small. Reserve is 1,000. And a paramilitary, which is police, is 3,000. Why we want to join the United States? We, our country wants to join the United Nations because we want really other peace and we don't want war. We want to have a good trading system with other countries since we don't have we don't have water around around us and we have we only have a, lot, a few resources so it will be easier to trade and we want some security. We, have, we want some military alliances with other countries since our military is so kind of small. This is the Constitution here, the link. And this is the Founders Blog Journal, and where we record our information and we post daily updates about our country. And this is our flag here. And the Does, does your country have any universities? Uh, we do have 
do, but it's like, kind of optional because, like, well, yeah, if the um, families are rich enough to like provide the money for the university, then they can go. And some some families might be poor, so they have to kind of help their family. They don't have to join university. Tell us about John. Well, we know about the strawberry farming. Did they talk about the employment? How they make the money? People make the money in the pantry. I'm sure. Did you? Don't worry. I've got the space there. If there are no more clarifying questions, please choose one. Of them. I know. Let me think here. Um, I'm not going to go down there. I had thought of one. Okay. When citizens are asked why they are proud to be a citizen of your country, how do they reply if they're proud? When they're asked if they're proud to be a citizen, well, I think they They would say it's very equal and like things are fair and they have a fair education and a chance to grow up and get a job. Even though it, even though they might be poor, everyone's equal. So so. When they, when they grow and they become rich again, they're kind of happy because their country helped them to be a better person in, the, in, in, in their life and that their future generations can be happier also, so it will make them happy.